Hey everyone, and welcome back. So, in today's video, we're doing what if every rocky planet orbited uh, Saturn. So, we have Mars, Mercury, Earth, and Venus, which they're all highlighted, so Mars is red, Earth is uh, a blue, Venus is a light blue, and Mercury is a purple, but also we have Earth's moon and both of Mars's moons, Phobos and Deimos right here. And before we do start, uh, all of Saturn's major moons are highlighted in yellow. So, you know, we got Exceladus, Tethys, Dione, Rhea, Titan, Minus, Iapetus. So anything outer here, like any other moons, uh, I deleted because there's really nothing much that's going to happen with them. But yeah, uh, let's get started. So chances are our moon is going to get destroyed pretty quick. If Mars's moons are sticking around, I don't know if that's going to stay like that. But so far, nothing much is going on. Oh, Venus may... I think Venus... Yeah, Venus will, I think. Yeah, we're going to have a first little collision. Satisfied. I think that's my favorite thing about this game. Just watching collisions happen. Yeah, Mercury collided with something. I have no idea what it collided with. And our moon's about to go to Saturn. Oh, look at that. That's cool. I want a collision with a bigger moon, I'm saying, like Dione or something. That may happen. Yep, it's gonna happen. Right in the Venus, right. Dione's gone. We have. What is that? Uh, they get lucky. Oh, Rhea. Rhea could collide. Rhea will. Yeah, there goes Rhea. Right in the Earth. Oh, chance there's no life on Earth anymore. I think it would be quite hard to leave and have life around because we're so far from the sun now. Mars is, you know, Mars is chilling out there, not doing much, still has its two moons. I wasn't too sure where, where to place Mars because I want to play, place it more out out here because of Titan and Hyperion or Iapetus. But at the same time, there's like no moons out here. And Earth is going to town. I have no idea what I collided with though. I think it's only, yeah. I think every other major moon of Saturn is gone besides Exceladus, Titan, and Iapetus. Who knows, maybe an Earth collide with Mimus or something. Let's speed up time. Oh, look at this. Venus and Earth. Who's larger? No, it's still Earth. There we go. Huge collision. That would, this looks like a really good thumbnail. Wait. Usually I make my thumbnails after the video, but the, the, that looks really cool. Look at that. I don't know if uh, Phobos or Deimos are getting affected. I think maybe Deimos, but I know the orbits are sort of eccentric. Oh, there goes that. No, no, Atlas is fine. Oh, oh my God! There goes, there goes uh, Mercury.
Yeah, yeah, Exodus is gone too. I didn't realize that. Ooh, another collision. Or maybe, I don't know. Yeah, it's another collision. Oh, there goes another one. We still got, we got Pandora. I don't know how to say most of these moons. The only really moon I know here is Pandora. Oh, and this, and this one. Is Earth getting torn up by Roosh Limit? Yeah. Oh, but Earth is very, very hot. At almost 5,000 degrees Celsius. In Fahrenheit, that would be this one. Yeah, there we go. Um, that would be 8,000. Degrees in Fahrenheit. Oh man, there goes another one. I don't think too much is gonna happen. Time some more, but I think after that, I don't think there's much is gonna happen. Maybe Titan and Mars, but I don't know. Well, there goes another one. This is like the last, last moon there. At least I was close to Saturn. These are just outer ones. Oh, that's gone. Okay. Well. I don't. I don't think much is gonna happen after this. Maybe Titan and Mars, but I don't think anything else is gonna happen. So yeah. Um. I guess that's it. I'll see you in the next one. See ya.